Here are three things you need to know for Saturday, March 23rd. New tonight, look at this. A Texas man taking a photo of another person's boarding pass and then using it to get on a Delta flight headed from Salt Lake City back to Austin. Once he was on the flight, a flight attendant noticed that he didn't have a seat and the plane taxied back to the gate. The man was arrested and he's facing a felony stowaway charge. He admitted to his mistake and says that he was simply trying to get home. Tonight, Russian President Vladimir Putin vowing retribution after what's being called the deadliest Russian terrorist attack in 20 years. The attack happened at a concert hall there as people gathered to watch a rock band. New video of four gunmen shooting into the crowd while people ran for the exits and hid behind seats. Sadly, more than 130 people have died and more than 100 others were injured. Islamic terrorist group ISIS has taken credit for the attack, but that connection has not been confirmed. All four gunmen were arrested near the border with Ukraine. Officials say they were planning to cross over. Ukraine says it is not connected to this attack in any way. And tonight, an outpouring of support for the Princess of Wales. People all over the world sending best wishes after she revealed her cancer diagnosis. Her condition had attracted a lot of speculation after there was a photo of her from Mother's Day that appeared to be photoshopped. Well wishers in Britain hoping for a fast recovery. My favorite royal, so I was really sad to hear about it actually. Yeah, so I really, whatever treatment she needs, I really hope it works for her and she recovers well. Princess Kate did not say which kind of cancer she was diagnosed with. She's 42 years old.